Hey you guys, welcome to your weekend edition Love and General Reading. This is for the element of fire. So if you're Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, or Rising, these messages are for you for the weekend of June the 16th through the 18th, 2023. So I want to thank you guys for all your love and support. Please keep in mind these are general. So they may or may not resonate, but hopefully you get some clarity. Uh, also, if you're wanting to book a personal or private reading, be sure to check the description box below for ways to reach me. Um, okay, so we have the overall energy is the Six of Swords. We have the Eight of Cups. We have the Four of Swords. We've ha we have the King of Swords. We've got the Two of Swords. We have the Five of Swords. Hmm. Strength. And the Eight of Pentacles. Okay. So, overall energies, I kind of feel like you guys are trying to move away from um, some sort of emotional turmoil. Um, you could be moving away from um, isolation. It just seems like you're trying to move on from the past. Um, also, if you have been holding on to something um, emotionally, it just seems like you were trying to keep to yourself or stay quiet uh, or keep peace. Maybe you've been private for a reason. And whatever has been going on, it just seems like you're ready to move on from that. Like, I feel like you're just wanting uh, to go in a different direction now. And it does seem like there's been some sort of changes going on in your life, or some sort of transformations going on. Um, and it also looks like you're being guided, too. So I don't know if you're aware of it or not, but it does seem like you're being guided um, in a new direction. I feel that you're having to trust your spirit guides and maybe that's something that you have been dealing with. And it does seem like something has been like happen happening or developing at a slow pace. Um... So I'm getting something in regards to your subconscious. You've been doing something um, on a subconscious level and maybe you weren't aware of it, but now you're becoming aware of it. Um, also, like your current situation, maybe things have been kind of mundane but I see a change coming. Now I'm also seeing um I'm also seeing like eights. So that's also talking about some sort of transformation for you guys. And I'm sorry, I said eight of cups, but uh actually seven of cups. But I still feel that the energy is the same. What I was getting is in regards to you know going through some sort of emotional turmoil and coming out of it going through transformations and coming out of it. In a love situation, I feel like there could have been some sort of confusion going on. Maybe you had confused feelings for someone or someone had confused feelings for you. There's also an indication that there were hidden feelings that someone was harboring that are maybe starting to bubble up from the surface now. Um, maybe someone is getting ready to confront the feelings that they've been um, keeping secret. Um, hmm. Something's going on where it seems like you're being guided towards an air sign, uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or possibly, <clears throat> excuse me, a Leo, or someone who has some sort of prominent Leo traits. Um, but I feel like you're being guided towards someone, and it seems like maybe you don't believe it or you don't 
trust it or you won't. I don't know if this has happened yet or not, but um, when they do come into your life or when someone does appear to you, it seems like you might have a problem um, trusting them, like you're coming off very guarded. It also could be that they're behaving the same way. Matter of fact, something's going on where you guys start to mirror each other's um, energy. Um, I feel like there is some sort of resistance. Um, definitely could be fighting off feelings that you're you're not wanting to have, and especially because. Like I said, these are some sort of hidden hidden feelings or hidden desires, basically, that you may be trying to ward off. Um, hmm. If you aren't the one that is trying to ward off these feelings, then this person is. Maybe you're unaware that someone is thinking about you. Um but at the same time, they are trying to ward off these feelings for whatever reason. Um, and these feelings are hidden or secret for a reason. It could be that um, maybe they're in a relationship and they shouldn't be having these thoughts. Maybe this is uh, a friend of yours and they're not supposed to be having these thought type of thoughts about you. Um, because... Part of this energy is about some sort of hidden desires. And these desires could be passion, sexual, you know, it's something that this person is trying to fight or ward off. Hmm. Also, there's something going on where maybe you are setting boundaries with people or you feel as if certain people shouldn't cross the line maybe someone has been you know stepping over your toes and you're having to like say something you're like okay i let that slide now i need to say something so it's possible that you're going to be um, defending yourself in one way or another. Spiritually, I feel that you're being protected. Like your spirit guides are protecting you from danger or dangerous situation. They're trying to stop you from doing something or going somewhere. So if something gets delayed, like you're trying to go on some sort of trip, and things keep getting delayed. Um, I feel like that is spirit's way of just protecting you. You you don't know. All you thinking is that you need to be get from point A to point B ASAP. And your spirit guides are like, no, like you don't. You know, this is part of a bigger uh, grand scheme. So we have to protect you. You don't see what's ahead of you. We do. And it's not safe for you to go at this time. You know, so it's something going on where maybe your guides are protecting you. Um, if you keep trying to get involved with someone who isn't good for you, your guides also could be stopping you or protecting you from moving forward with this person. Um, hmm. There's a possibility of someone thinking about visiting you, but there keeps being blockages. Mm. I keep getting something about protection. Something needs to be protected. You might be protecting your work in some way, having to protect your work or having to protect something that you're um, working on. This could be something mundane, like maybe you are building something outside and it's gonna rain over the weekend. Well, you need to put some sort of barrier over your workspace if you're working outside. Um, 
I feel that you guys are also trying to save your money up for some things or you're thinking of ways of how to uh, build your wealth. Hmm. Ultimately, it just seems like you guys are, you guys keep being redirected with something that you're wanting to do. And you keep having to um, re-strategize something. Something you're having to restructure something in your life too. I feel like whatever you've been planning out isn't going to go according to plans. Like you're having, you're going to have to change some things. And I don't know what your plans were, but I, I just feel like you need to change them. This can be something as simple as a dentist appointment um, to, you know, whatever. But I feel like you're going to have to change some things around. Uh, I also feel that there's something in regards to animals or a pet that's standing out. I don't know if you've been feeling sensitive towards pets or like you're going to a shelter, you feel the need to adopt a pet, um, or if you're rest, you feel like you need to rescue a pet. Maybe there's a kitten that keeps showing up to your doorstep and you're feeding them or protecting them or some way. Um, but something about protecting animals seems kind of significant too. Hmm. Uh, going back to anything spiritual, I feel like you're needing to pay attention to your spirit animals, um, including insects and things of that sort, reptilians. Um, Reptilians, <laughs> reptiles, I don't know. <clears throat> Y'all had a crazy dream about Kanye. This is so off topic. Like I know everybody is talking about um, trying to figure out if, if he's a clone or whatever. Um, and I did try to pull like a couple of cards. I've been getting different things though. Um, I will say the last... I did have a dream about him a few months ago and I was looking at his eyes and one of them was a reptilian eye. And so, I don't know y'all. I'm sorry to like, just like, this is like coming through your reading. Like, I don't know why this is, this is uh, talking about uh, Kanye through your reading, but I don't know. I just felt the need to talk about it. <laughs> But yeah, I don't know. I kind of feel like I know what it means. I kind of feel that he is half something. I don't, I have a different take on the clone theory. I have, uh, even though I do have a very open mind, I'm not closed minded to it. I just am not ready to accept that everybody's a clone. Like that is, I get it. It can be done. I'm just having a hard time accepting that. I'm more on the lines of um, mind control or something even being implanted in the mind and making someone become a different person that I, I can, I can see. And, um, especially with that Neuralink chip, um, and you know, he used to hang with Elon Musk a lot. So who knows what's going on with that? But, um, I don't know. I'm so sorry that I, I kind of went on a different tangent about that but I just felt like I had to bring that up so <laughs> but yeah I am getting something about thoughts in the mind a lot do your reading and I do have air out so you know maybe there is something significant about that air sign or especially like a Gemini energy around you um Maybe you feel the need to protect someone or they feel the need to protect you. Mm, if you are someone who is a writer, um, 
something could be going on where you are getting some very good ideas, some creative ideas. And I was going to say that maybe you're needing to like protect your work. So be cautious about the ideas that you share with other people. thinking about you but they're keeping it a secret they're being quiet mm. I feel like someone's interested in you you make them laugh but I also feel that someone is wanting to do the right thing maybe this person's also trying to justify why they should approach you In regards to paperwork or documents, I feel that something is needing to be signed or maybe people are needing to reach an agreement on something. Um, whether it's some sort of work contract or what, but it seems like maybe there's something going on in regards to written agreements, documents, signatures. Um, it's possible if you're an artist that maybe you're receiving some sort of offer to be signed. Someone might be promising to make you famous. Mm. I feel that something's going on in regards to a secret agreement. You might end up making some sort of secret agreement to someone. Career-wise, it seems like um, something I was getting in regards to career. Hold on. What was that I was just picking up about career? Why are my thoughts leaving my head? Oh yeah, okay, so I, I was getting something in regards to you possibly waiting for a response. Maybe you interviewed or filled out some sort of applications and it's possible that you're gonna get some sort of response. Even if something is a no, Metaphysically, if someone's been astral traveling or visiting you in dreams, um, I feel like maybe you're trying to make them stop or vice versa. Maybe you're the one that's been astral traveling and someone is like trying to stop you from visiting them. I'm getting the name Malaysia. I don't know if that's talking about a person or the actual place. a fear of betrayal someone maybe does not want to betray another person boy okay it, it just I keep getting blockages like someone is trying to get through someone is trying to come to you think of thinking of you but they're being blocked for some reason
Hmm. I also feel that there's something in regards to a breakup or a separation. Something could lead to a breakup or a separation. I feel that there is a possibility that someone could betray um, an earth sign by being with you or thinking about you. And they don't want to do that. Oh my goodness. Y'all got so much air coming through your reading. There's an air sign in your energy. And there's two people thinking about each other that are trying to resist it or being distant with each other. Mm. Hmm. I kind of feel that somebody has been talking about you as well. Not in a like you you're in someone's conversations. They're like discussing something something maybe trying to find answers or advice about what they should do and someone is telling them don't do that. And I feel like they still want to. If someone has been distant with you, I feel that they are being inf heavily influenced by what someone is saying to them or telling them. Okay, I feel like there's going to be some sort of communication. Some sort of communication is being blocked, but I feel like eventually there is going to be communication. Also, if you have blocked someone from seeing your page, I feel like somebody's going to remove a block or vice versa. Maybe you're removing a block so someone can see your page. Also, either you are being very disciplined. It seems that either way, there are some sort of power struggles going on. There, there are people who have strong opinions, people who have strong um, beliefs, people who don't act until they're ready to. Um, if someone is trying to tempt you or seduce you, I feel that you are very disciplined and you're not going to fall for it or you're going to be able to con control those desires in the same if it's the other way around. If you're trying to seduce someone, they're not going to take the bait until and they feel like it. Um, this person also would probably prefer to take the lead in that especially if it's more of the alpha male energy. They want to be in control of when a conversation takes place. Career-wise, you might be doing a lot of strategizing. I feel like you're really, you're thinking, you're brainstorming about some things. There's something that you, you really want, but there's a blockage and you're trying to figure out how do you uh, remove this blockage? How do you get through it? How do you think outside the box? It's something that you're wanting. And I feel like you're determined to attain this goal, whatever it is.
you bring out someone's animalistic nature um, or their their primal nature. Um, and I feel like this person is really trying to tame those desires. This person has a hard time taming those desires. Now, what I'm also getting is that someone wants to leave a situation, but they haven't. Um, it's like they're courageous or you're courageous. I see that there is courage there, but then there's something that kind of stops something from happening. And then they lose a little bit of courage, but they then it's like, OK, let me try again. Let me keep going. If this is about someone opening up to you or pursuing you, it's a lot of factors. I feel that the situation is actually very complicated. And it seems like this person is trying to build up the courage to come forward. But it's something there's a mental block. Someone keeps thinking that they can't they can't do this. I really feel like. This person feels like they shouldn't be thinking of you this way. And they don't want to hurt another person, especially an earth sign. And then the other message that I'm getting, uh, main message is about being protected. Like something is for your protection. Maybe someone is being overprotective. Um, it could be a father, father figure, your siblings. Um, someone's being overprotective or this is spirit protecting you. Mm. Someone also might have a pet for protection. Like maybe you need a guard dog and you're like, oh, you know, it's been a lot of robberies around this neighborhood. I'm going to get a, a dog, you know, so it could be uh, someone getting a dog to protect their home. Um, hmm. Yeah, those are that's the main two energies I'm getting about protection and then somebody trying to come towards you but they they're turned on but they I don't know something's stopping them from going through or crossing that boundary with you all right so let's see what energy cards are coming out All right, additional messages for fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising for this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. We have walking away, yin and yang, community, overall energy, angel of balance. All right. So like the first part of the reading, you guys are wanting to have some sort of balance or peace in your life. I feel like you want to move on from a situation that is maybe emotionally draining or confusing. Something's going on where it does look like maybe you're wanting to leave. 
Um, it still applies to that situation where I feel like there is someone who wants to be with you. They want to leave their current situation and come to you. Um, maybe this person feels like you're their, like you're their match. Um, and so that could be still something that is a possibility. Um, I feel like you are going to make some sort of significant connection this weekend, um, whether it's love or, you know, connecting with people who have share similar spiritual beliefs, um, or if you are connecting with, you know, people from some sort of social group, maybe even dating. It, it seems like something's going on where maybe you just need a break or you need to escape your current situation to find peace. And I do feel like you're going to find peace. And I feel like you're also going to be in alignment um, with your purpose, your soul's purpose. There's also a possibility that you're being pushed away out of you're being pushed out of a situation so that you can be in alignment with your soul's purpose. <clears throat> I feel like you're going to be engaging in friendships and conversations. Um in regards to dating for some of you, you could be open to dating or maybe there's someone that you're interested in dating um, that would kind of take you out of your comfort zone. I kind of feel like you guys are in search of fun as well. Like you want to do something that's fun. Mm. Ultimately, I feel like somebody is leaving behind an old situation and finding peace, finding balance. I feel like balance is going to be restored into your life. Um, <clears throat> also, something or someone could find you. Maybe you are someone's peace. So hopefully these messages help. Uh, feel free to leave your feedback. Thank you guys for watching. Sydney Love and Grace.